almost the entire show is sung. The majority of it is either sung, sung and danced, or just danced. Yeah, How's it's it going? my 20th show here. It's hopeless! You said it, kid. Who's there? It's me, Maisie. I feel like right now I'm just trying to be like the best role model and inspiration I can be to get all of these new middle schoolers interested and excited about the arts department here because it's so amazing. I think as high schoolers we can lose a little bit of energy sometimes just because we're so stressed out. But the middle schoolers just bring that kind of oomph that keep us inspired, keep us going. And I think they're just so determined to be a part and put in their best work um, because they're younger and want to get better. It's a combination of uh, about somewhere between 12 and 15 of the Dr. Seuss stories all kind of woven into the story of these two dreamers, one in the, the jungle of Newell, Horton, who finds this speck of dust that is talking. And he realizes there's, there could be a whole world on that speck of dust, and he catches it on a clover. In the meantime, down on the speck of dust is Jojo, also completely isolated from everybody that, that loves him and cares about him because he's a dreamer. So these two very disparate worlds uh, both have these dreamers. A piece of art is never finished. Yeah.